Matt and I just had a heart to heart. I believe him about the Carlton thing. I, I, now you're gonna pull out that it's a joke. No, no, I'm not pulling out that it's a joke. I <laughs> seriously didn't know his name was not Carlton. That kind of makes me sad though that you didn't know, cause Carlton's a big figure. I really never watched the show. I've seen like two episodes and I've seen YouTube poops. <laughs> Dude, I didn't have cable when I was younger. I, you gotta think, I didn't have cable until you're, I was in like high school. God, your experience with Fresh Prince of Bel Air or Fresh Prince of Bel Air YouTube poops? <laughs> like, That's really? pretty much my Fresh Prince experience. <laughs> That's awful. There's, there's a really good YouTube poop by a user called Crobo Productions, so I don't even know if it is around anymore. But he, uh, you know, he did a good, he did a good mashup of, of when Will's talking about um, his father. It's very funny. I've seen, I've seen that episode. When Will's father comes back and Man, how come you him. don't want me, man? Daddy, how come you don't love me? Uncle Phil, how come daddy don't love me? <laughs> Uncle Phil and Butler Carlton? <laughs> Joffrey? Who the fuck is Joff- Oh! Joff- Oh, fuck. Joffrey, I'm sorry, I've been calling you Carlton this whole time. Wait, like Joffrey from Game of Thrones? Joffrey from, um... Ah, fucking- Booligan? Didn't you already fight Booligan? Most wanted Boo. You already got Booligan, though. I don't think I got him. I think he disappeared oh, he into this room him. over here. Just sucked that boy off? Yes! Okay, he didn't disappear into the room. Gotcha. Got 11 yes. Boos now. Yowzers. You have 8 million Gs. You could say I'm part of the G unit. <laughs> 50 cents, Luigi's Mansion. 50 Yo, 50 Cent needs to make like a game with ghosts, you know? He did Blood on the Sand, he did Bulletproof, he's gotta- Seriously, if 50 Cent wants to make a lot of money, he just needs to keep making games and keep making them goofier and goofier. You know? You think? But the thing is, I don't know if 50 Ooh. Cent would be like, in on that joke, and if he'd want to. What the f- Look how big this baby's getting. It's like a prolapsing anus, I did not like that. I- I, I need to get a house plant. I just- I just want a little house plant to keep like a pet that I can tend to and water every day. And maybe like a house plant you can pet and tend to. No, no, I, it's like a pet because oh, I take care of it. Okay, yeah, yeah. I can name it, and then uh, maybe it'll freshen the air in my room even more. Dude, I saw something online on Reddit. Someone to make their uh, car like feel nice and fresh. They put a huge house plant in the back of their car, and they said it just makes it feel nice and crisp in there. Really? Because it, it's all it's sucking up CO two and producing all uh, new oxygen all the time. Yeah, but. How does it get sunlight often? Do they drive often? I guess they kept- it was like, uh, it was like where the sun could hit it. Ah. I really want to get a, a little plant for my room, I just don't know where I'd put it. You ready for this, dude? Oh. You ain't ready for this. Yo, I'm ready for this. No, you ain't. Yes, I am. No, you ain't. Yes, I am. No, you ain't. I said I am, which means I am. Okay, then, look! Oh. Fuck! Told you you weren't ready for this shit. I wasn't, I said I was, but it turns out I wasn't and I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Ellipses. My big brother. Why? How many games does Mario go inside of paintings? Oh, whoa. You got a key. Damn, dog. You got yourself a key. Where's this key go to? Show me, my friend. Show me the key. Show me, my friend. Show me the Carfax. You ever gotten water from a well? No, have you? Yeah, when I was uh, in high school. I went on a, a, a church trip to Jamaica to build some houses, and this little village had a well. And, um, leave it to me, the goofy white boy, to drop the bucket down the well. You... what? I dropped the, their, like, only bucket down the well. The bucket that they used to get water? <laughs> I dropped it down the well. Because it was on, it was on a rope! And this kid was having a hard time getting the water up, so I'm like, here, I'll, I'll help you. And he kind of, like, reluctantly gave it to me and just stared up at me. And I lowered it down and it hits the water and it just sits on the surface because I guess it didn't drop down at a, a, a high enough force. So I'm like, okay, I'll drop it harder. So I, uh, I'm like, I'll throw it down. It's on a rope. So I throw it down and then I saw the end of the rope just go down the well. And I was like, oh my God. And the little kid just looked up at me like, you stupid white boy. And he ran and got his, he probably was like, I'm about to get beat. And he ran and got his dad. And then him and like three other Jamaican dudes had to use like a series of like bamboo sticks and like lower each other down into the well to pull it out, all because of my mistake. So, to that Jamaican village, I sincerely apologize. I fucked up on that one. At least so. it's not painting someone's house a horrible color. <laughs> I love that story. Mustard yellow, and then the roof was fucking forest green. Oh, God. Or the trimming, sorry, the trimming. That sounds awful. Or That's like something out of like a kid's show. 
It was awful. It looked so bad. I'd be so mad if like a group of like, church kids were like, I wasn't expecting it to be this color. We'll, we'll paint your house. I'm like, all right, maybe a nice beige, maybe a, a light blue, maybe something very, just very neutral. Because I guess that's the thing when you're painting a house. Unless you have an idea in mind for something crazy, like a theme, you just want it to be neutral. Houses are usually very neutral. Like maybe like a nice earth tone. But no, you guys painted it mustard <laughs> yellow. <laughs> it was just, it looked horrible. I'd love to travel to that house and see if they ever painted it back. You probably cost them more work because they probably had to paint it back. Oh no. He's swinging, no, he's swinging. Fuck. I'm gonna catch those hands, boy. I hate how, like. Okay. Are we good? Hey, it's the house's uvula. That's not what that is. Remember, uh, Monster House? I know that Dan it's Harmon girl, wrote Monster House. It's a girl house. She's got a uvula. Yo, all my bitches got uvulas. Fuck. I just beat myself up. Uh, that's just a fun fact. Dan Harmon was one of the writers for Monster House. Was he really? Yeah. I found that out. Good for him. I was editing the Game Grumps, uh, Dan Harmon Guest Grumps, and I looked at his Wikipedia page. He's got Monster House on there. He worked with Robert Zemeckis. Is that how you say it? Robert Zemeckis? Yeah. Yeah. He did- he directed Forrest Gump, right? Uh, I think so. I think so. Cause I remember in the Monster House trailer, I swear one of them said like, from one of the- from like the director of Forrest Gump, and I was like, huh. Jenny, this house is haunted. Jenny! Jenny. Jenny, I don't want- I don't want a son, Jenny. Well, I'ma give you one, Forrest, and I gave you AIDS. Oops. He didn't get AIDS. The son probably got AIDS, dude. She was pregnant, she had fucking AIDS. Okay. Wouldn't, wouldn't the baby be born with AIDS? With the what? That's a really, like, I never thought of that. She had AIDS or HIV or something from her, her party days. She gave birth to a son and had sex with Forrest. Technically, doesn't that mean that both of them could have AIDS? The son and Forrest? Potentially Forest? they could. Ginny, why didn't you why'd you do that? Look, she she was just having some fun. She's just goofing. She's just having a goof. She didn't mean it. She didn't mean it. She was... She she was just... It was a prank. Okay? It was a social experiment. What's up, guys? Today's prank is gonna be giving Forrest Gump and his son AIDS. Fun fact, our uh, Goofs TV video we made a long time ago, um, the intro for that video, we hired the same guy that made, like, all the big actual prank YouTube channel oh, intros, yeah. we hired the same guy to make ours, so that Goofs TV intro is, uh, legit. It's by the guy that made- I don't even remember the pranksters' names anymore. All the big ones Fuck back it. then, that we made fun of, I don't even remember their names. I'm trying to think. Um... I know SoFlo technically- SoFlo, I remember him. I don't remember the other ones, though. There was- who was the creepy one? That, like, kissed girls a lot? I don't know. See, that's how forgettable they are. Whoa, you can actually run on it. Yeah, it's hard to go straight. Burn some calories, man. Holy shit. Wait, there's a ladder behind it. Do you have to move Try it? to stay on this treadmill. Alright, guys, I'm playing. I'm giving it a try. Welcome to Map Plays. Hmm. There you go. Oh, shit, the key came out of it. <laughs> the fuck is that? Sounds like a Pikmin. <laughs> Yo, Miyamoto, come on. Get that new Pikmin game out, buddy. Pikmin, Animal Crossing, Luigi's Mansion. Smash Bros got a lot of titles I'm waiting on. He's never gonna. Pikmin 4 is never coming out. I swear. It's. Mm. Oh, d oh, shit, dude. Oh, damn! I thought. Uh, <laughs> oh, <wait>. God! <coughs> oh. Sorry, ma'am. Scared me. <laughs> Choked on myself. What's in here? Looks like a, a wheel? Oh, a projector? No, it's a sewing machine? It's Nana's room. Grandma. I'm gonna jostle your... I'm, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna jostle your innards, baby. That's the. I think that's the best pickup line, guys, if you want to get a girl... Uh, jostle to, your to innards? Say, hey, baby, I'm gonna jostle your innards up with my fuck stick. Ugh. Woo! Ugh. Whoa, Whoa, God damn! This part of the mansion, these ghosts are getting rich. This is where all the rich people are staying. Ow. Stop. I've never seen a grown man get hurt by a ball of yarn rolling into his shoe. Oh my god. They could, oh, my oh my jeez. Jesus fucking Christ. Stop! You have to suck it up and then hit her with it? There you go. Okay, that's two. Boom! 
You're mine, you old bitch. Go, 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 go. Yes, yes. You got her. You got her. You got this old bitch. You old hag. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have called her an old bitch. It just slipped out. I got I got excited in the moment. I should never call a woman a bitch. Heat of the moment. All right. Oh, you just annihilated that granny. She did, bro. <laughs> the first time. What? Nothing. Woo! Got a key. Let's see where this where where this key get, gets me, bro. Let's see. Man, where we going now? I need ice, bro. I don't know, bro. I need some ice, bro. Why you need ice? I need to make that woman freeze in the shower, bro. You gonna do the the ice in the shower prank? Yeah, bro. Made popular by famous Vine star Lance Stewart. Ugh. I watched a compilation on uh, it popped up on Facebook yesterday of Lance Stewart's vines. Some of them were funny. For the most part, Excuse it was me? tremendously. Whoa, he's a tremendous you, douchebag. What are you saying? There was like one or two I laughed at. The rest were just so unfunny. Like they're just dickish. Well, I mean, he is a. He is a dick. He is a dick. Yeah. So. I would like to fight Lance Stewart. Okay. I'm putting that out. <laughs> Wait, really? I would like to fight Lance Stewart. Lance Stewart, American Vine star. Please fight me. Lance Stewart is the same guy who like. Shows his like he has his girlfriend's cleavage in all of his YouTube yep, thumbnails, yep. right? Because the video was uh, it was like a woman's breast, and they weren't even in the video at all. I'm surprised YouTube allows that. I, know. I mean, uh, Facebook allows that. Try to look up YouTube thumbnails uncensored. Not gonna happen. Get that boy with a big mouth. I meant to. He's coming in for a kiss. Oh no. <sighs> Woo! Oh no! He's coming in for a hug too. I don't, I don't like, like hugs. A hug too. Michelle, stay back. Obama's mansion. You know how I get on there? How do you get on there? <laughs> what do you do? <laughs> Whoa! What the frick? This is like, I think the only part in the game where you do this shit. I feel like there was just one de uh, developer who was like, can we just put this in just for one part? He wanted to be like a main feature and everyone said no, so like, we'll put it in one room. <laughs> just for you. Oh, ice. Thanks, guys. What? Yes, Egad, I can control, I, I have ice abilities now. Egad, my man. He's seen some shit in his days, dude. dude. Look at him, he's like, oh. He looks like he's insane now. Mario? So I got a hat, a letter. What else? There was his gloves and then his uh, star or something. Okay. Okay. That's I know there's there's ghosts in there's here. There's gotta be, if you can climb up there, there's a reason. Oh, it's shaking. I knew it. I knew it. Gotcha. Oh, oh he's gone. Little. You, you spooked him? Let me shake it Now more. he's gone. How am I supposed to fucking make him turn fast? Is that what you have to do? Yeah. To make the little kids appear, and then they're gonna play a game, I think. Or maybe this is something I have to do during the battle. But I know there's two little kids in here. What? Is it doing anything? No. Is that how, is that how it says you make them appear? No, it doesn't say. It says all you- it's all it says is spin the- the helicopters. Spin the airplane mobile hanging from the ceiling. Oh, <laughs> fucking- What? Fuck 